are booktube channels profitable a question came in with someone that said hey sean i have a booktube channel about dark fantasy books and it currently grows slowly but i'd love to hear your take would you consider this niche profitable so i think every niche can be profitable we're living in an era where you can truly monetize your passion you can as gary v says you can cash in on your passion but i think that the question becomes certain business models are better fitted to different types of channels. In your case, I think you're gonna need a bigger audience because you get views and ad revenue. Maybe a bigger, a smaller audience that maybe supports you on Patreon or channel memberships because you they really love discussing them. They want exclusive live streams or Q&A with you. Maybe you do deep dives of, you know, kind of like book theory, game theory kind of stuff about characters, you take stuff deeper. So, you, so it's crowdfunding, it's YouTube ads, you know, with affiliate links, books aren't that expensive. So affiliate link, somebody clicks and buys the book, they make a dollar or two if you do a book review. It's another way to make money. And so I'd say this, there are much more profitable niches, like it's more profitable, real estate's more profitable, e-commerce is more profitable, medical, you know, a lot of times it's how much money is in the system itself. And so in some cases, if you want to have big money with a small channel, you wanna be in a high profit, high CPM, high RPM niche, if your vision is more community building and you're committed to long haul to build a big enough audience. You know, I think about the case study of Ryan Holiday. He built up an email subscription list of people who just love books. And he reads pretty widely history, stoicism, self-help, business. But eventually it was like 10,000, 50,000, 150,000. If you built up a newsletter of people that were also into dark fantasy stuff and then it's 100,000 people in the newsletter in the next one year, three years, five years, and you send out an email, then even just the affiliate links to a book or whatever at scale could be really interesting, but now it's maybe groups, you could do events, you could do meetups. So anything could be profitable when it comes to YouTube. I think the key is figuring out the right business model. In fact, we have a class on this. If you go to thinkmasterclass.com, I have a one hour training that'll help you get a clearer path of the best way to profit from your YouTube channel. So if you wanna check that out, it's at thinkmasterclass.com. But keep going, keep posting, and keep being 1% better with every upload. And I really believe the profit will come over time as you keep getting your skills to the next level. If you like this clip and are ready to take your YouTube channel to another level, go to thinkmasterclass.com where you can get access to a one hour YouTube strategy class where I break down the exact system that we use at Think Media to generate hundreds of thousands of views per day. Just go to thinkmasterclass.com or click the link in the description.